Hello. Hi. How you doing today? Fine. That's good. Yeah, we have, we have, sorry, um, I was a little concerned, but you guys are running behind, I guess, huh? Well, yeah, and I'm the only one person, so I have like two other people oh. that I have to take the iPad to. They haven't brought Miss um, Charlie back yet? Seems, no. Oh, Lord. I'm sorry. Wait, you're not going to wave at me today? Oh. You. No. <laughs> That's where I know I see you. And hey, Mommy. Okay. Yeah, how you doing? I'm going to call my other sibling. Know. All right, thank you. I sure um, you miss you, Brian, because your mom. That, that's her mother. Oh, her mom? Yeah, hold, hold on one second. Let me just. Oh, yeah, that's what I said, her mom. Yeah, oh, okay. Then how did she respond? Did she look at it today? Yeah, She's so she was moving her arm, and then she stopped when she looked up at the picture. Oh, okay. And she started at it for a little bit. Okay. Well, well. I'm, are you still there? Hello? 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 Yeah, I don't know how we got disconnected. It's okay, but my siblings are trying to call me instead of waiting for me to call them, but that's okay. I'm going to call them now. Thank you. All right. We okay. Bye. Thank you. Okay. All right. Bye-bye. Hello? What's wrong with this phone? With the connection? 2D. Yeah, what's wrong with the connection? You don't see mine? Yes, yeah. Yeah, y'all tried to call me. You still have to wait for me to call. I ain't trying to call you. So I might, it was a whole other group trying to call. That's okay, I'm getting getting everybody now. So you're first. Yeah, I'm going to get Diane. Hold on one second. There's mom. She, Diane, you on? Yeah. Okay, mom had the picture of mama a minute ago. You said she had the picture? Yeah, they had. They don't want to keep it because it's glass, you know. Hey, too. Hey, Diane. I was just talking to Tracy, Jimmy. I just had to hang on real quick. That's okay. Hold on one second. I'm trying, trying to get Cern. I got a word for y'all. They called me. I said, what's going on? Yeah, you didn't see my message? No, I, I, I was going to call with my boss, so I had not had a chance to check my phone. Yeah, I, I was saying they were behind schedule because they only got the one person, and they just got so many people they got to do. Right. So I called them, and just when I called, she, she checked in. So that's Sharon. Is that Sharon? Yep. That must be her. Well, I'm she's waiting, so hold on one second. Okay. And they don't tell you who it is when they call you? Yeah, they, when future they call, they do. Mom's been put, putting that baby in the camera the whole time. Oh, and when you so say she, she oh, has Hold on one second. Who was that? What would you say to me? Yeah, it looked like the whole group was trying to call. It was like, how'd that happen? Well, that's, that's probably just a connection. Yeah, but it's okay. We, if, I, I don't know where Sharon is, but it's, I'm ringing her. Who is this red thing down the bottom? That's Sharon. Oh. So let me try to get Jason, and then if I can't get him, we'll just go around, the, you know, go around so everybody can say hi. And then there's something going on. There's a whole lot of noise. Who's that? I don't know. Who's anybody? watching TV? Anybody? Not me. I'm in the dining room table. Y'all jump behind me. Oh, maybe it's mom's room. Hold, yeah. Let me try Jason just to see. I'm going to try to get everybody. Okay. Here's Jason. You see a yellow yellow box now? Yeah, I see it. That's Jason. Did everybody, anybody tell you that was going to be on this call? No, it's just you, 
Tootie and Sharon. So I tried to get Sharon. No, no answer. But if, if she if she picks up, it'll pop up. I'm gonna try to get Rachel anyway. Well, I'm just working in the meantime, y'all. Okay, well, I, here's a, I tried Rachel, I tried Jason, I tried Sarah, and that's everybody. So, you, so you, you wanna, I'm going to make you big for a second. You want to speak to mom? Yeah. I'll holler and see if you can get her. Okay, let me know. Yeah, you big, big smile. Okay, you're going to smile, right? Hi, mom. How you doing? Can you see me waving? Hi, mom. 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 Cause they just showed up. They just showed the picture of mine. It's one, it should be on the film a little bit. But they were they, they were they were running so late today. Diane, you want to try? I'm just making it big for a second. Hold on one second. Go ahead. Sharon, are you, is that your seal, Sharon? Yeah, that's Sharon. I'm here. You're gonna, yeah. I'm making you big so you can holler at mom for a second. Hi, Madison. Hi. Who are you? Say hi. Hi. Say hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. That's great, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. Tina came in here. Grandma. Yes, I'm typing. I got help in the type. My name, Mom's awake. Madison. Here. Talk to them. Hey, Mommy. How you doing? Okay, so talk to them a little bit. I'm doing okay. How are you doing? Miss Betty, how you doing? Later. Say hello. Hello. Hi, Madison. Say hi, Grandma. Hi, Grandma. That's our great grandmother, ain't it? What's the name she said? Matt, Rat, Cat, Bat, Bat. Oh, no. Hey, Mommy. Glad this day off is, that, is that a good baby? The baby been good? She, Mom had the picture. They, had the, they definitely let her see the picture every day. I got had some girls. Why did I put brown on Mom anymore? What's going on with that? I don't know. Probably because she don't get out. She don't leave, never leave the room. Oh, and it's okay. probably easier to just dress because they, they only got a dresser. They probably dressed her just to sit up and watch us. Okay. Yeah. Probably during the rest of the week, she probably stay that's in the house coat or something. That's what I do. Because they're not, they don't come out the room. And it, you know, one, did you, if you got the report, there was one staff member that got sick. I see that. But they, but they don't know what's wrong with them. No, they got, they had all the symptoms of COVID 19. They sent them home. I mean, they tell people what to do. You know, they, they try to tell them to be careful, but they it's not somebody was involved with the, the residents anyway. Okay. So they they made sure to get them out of there. But that's just, it's just one of those things. You got these, uh -oh, mom just went out of the sheet. Can you still see her? No. No. I see a caution sign. Yeah, because you see those, these millennials, you can't tell them nothing. They know everything. They right. all of them are convinced it's a hoax, so they they young and invincible. And so I'm gonna call them and tell them it's off right now. We just got connected and No, I'm just trying to keep them because I can sign on at four o'clock. I need it. I'm tired of working today. If I can get Miss Desi an activity, please. 
She's on her way now to fix it. So she just got to come down the hall. I wonder what happened. This side, this side, every now, every, it's overcast a little bit today. It could be the clouds. Because it's a, it's a wireless signal. So I'm going to try to go and get my picture one day this weekend. Okay. I'll, I'll be here. I'll call you. All right. When I try to venture. I haven't been going out. So I haven't been out since Sunday. Really? People are just stupid as hell. They, 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 they got something for them. They, they can, they can, yeah, they can, was out there like it was nothing. Yeah. And I said, I say the kids get back in the car. Stop stopping you. Came on so hopefully she's going to pop back in a second and just come on. Where were we at? Up in Marlboro, down there by Chris. Uh-oh. So have you been back out to Richardson's? No. 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 Yeah, I mean, I thought you might have been out to the farm, though. You haven't been? I ain't been. Oh, you I haven't been out the house? I've been in the house. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've been out. I've been out. Yeah. I'll be back in the picture this week. Sure. Okay. I, I don't um, go out much, but that's one of the places I go. My dad's in Home Depot. Because I always got little projects. And those places, I, mean, I don't take the mask off. I wear rubber gloves. You know. Yeah. If you go to Home Depot for Lowe's. Home Depot for right now. Well, the guy who used to be the president of Lowe's, of Home Depot gave money to Trump. But I'm going to tell you a little secret. The reason why I have a problem with Lowe's is that if you need technical advice, at Home Depot, they hire people who retire. Like, if you need somebody to tell you about plumbing, they have retired plumbers there. They hire people who did the work. Lowe's, they just have salespeople. You go to Lowe's and say, I need to get, you know, a J-trap. They be looking at you like, what are you talking about? Oh. You go to a Home Depot, you need an electrical issue, you can talk to the person, figure out how to do it yourself. Or a lot of times, they will show you how to do something. That's the, that's the catch. I, I, I wish I could spend the money with Lowe's, but I'm frustrated every time I go in there and ask somebody a question, and they don't know nothing. Yeah. You know, all they know how to do is ring, the, ring up your sale, and that's it. Yeah. I've had people at Home Depot save me money because they showed me how to fix something that I would have hired somebody to fix. I fixed it myself. Okay, hold on one second. This is them, so let's see if I can get them. Hello? Uh-oh. Hello? Oh, okay. I see mine. I got to call my siblings again, but thank you. You're welcome. All right, sorry to bug you. Hello. Okay. Oh, good. I'm glad you caught it. They had to. They had to call me again. Yeah, did you call now? Yeah. Hold on one second, Diane. I gotta get everybody else back. Okay, who's that? Me. Okay, Diane, and I'm trying to get to you. 
So I'll have to pick up again. I was scared to accept it because I don't want to knock nobody out. Okay, well. Wow. Okay, Sharon, you got it. So, then, too, you got to pick up. Uh, the only one missing is Tootie. Uh, that's her roommate. She said, hi. Yeah. What is your name? That's fine. Yes. So, the only one now is Tootie. Well, Diane, is that your ceiling? Oh, is that you, Sharon, saying, can you see? I can see you fine. But there's somebody else was saying, hey. Well, I'm looking. Because she's up playing with that dog now, so. Hey, Mom. Mom, you Yeah. Hey, Mom. Yeah. Two D. She's off. I said, "You see a yellow box?" No. You don't see it at all. Uh -uh. Let me try to get. I try it again. Two D is one four one o five o one o two one o. Now, what you say? You doing? Uh, what kind of sound? Okay, it, she says it's not ringing. I've been trying for a while. It's just that, were you on the other line? No, were you still on the other call? I had, uh, I just texted you and said, it's not right. Yeah, and I was telling you that I, I was going to say, if you were still connected to the other connection, hang up, but you already got in, so yeah, go figure. Know. Yeah, but we in. We got, we got mine for a couple of minutes, so. Everybody want to yell and scream at him. Miss Betty's going to chime in. So ain't nothing we can do. But Mom's looking at us. Hey, hey Mom, you going to wave at us today? Hey, look at she hey, She's leaning forward. Hey, you going to wave? Hey, you want to wave at us? Hey, Mom, look at us one time. Hey, yeah. Mom, open your eyes. Let me see your eyes. Hey, she, she I hope she didn't touch it. No, she's back. No, her hand was at her chest holding the baby. Yeah, I was hoping she didn't lean forward. Now, they said us there's might rain, so the dust you got. You can see it? Yeah, I can. Uh, if you make her smile, you can post it up for them. I made a little one I can see it, but I don't see it at all. Well, it's probably the weather because it's cloudy and it's supposed to, we might get it's a storm. It's supposed to rain, yeah. That's enough to drive you to drink. I remember that. Let's see who. Time, 
I'm gonna try one more time. Forget them. Okay. Madison, please. Oh, I, got, I see your message, too. Okay. Waiting. I see your message. Yeah, but if mom don't know how to answer it, so what it would do is if, if they walk in and they don't know, all they got to do is click, touch the button and rejoin the conversation. Yeah, but this one, it, it's just a bad connection. I don't think it's a girl's fault. Well, when they, I guess when they get their more patients back and more residents back and they'll rehire her. But the, she was really in love with mom, that girl Chardé. She sure was. Yeah. That's the one that was going mom's family. Yeah, all the time. She, she was just crazy about mom. So let me try one more time before, before they hang up on us. See if we can get a couple more minutes. And who's that? Oh, that was you, Diane. Cut it off. That's probably why they were late today. They probably had bad connections everywhere. Okay. Uh, I she have phones? Yeah. Yeah. Y'all see the thing that Wanda Lee put on Facebook with her niece, great niece missing? If I can try to get our activities. Wanda Lee, great niece missing. I think it's Miss Desi and activities. Thank you. A great name? She's like 15 or 16. Uh, know who that could be. Look on Facebook, it's on there. They've been missing, I think, since yesterday. Oh, sir. Oh, uh, I'm so squid, but I don't know how to disconnect it. Look on Facebook, they don't want to know how to disconnect it. Yeah, we keep losing the connection. Now, this time, I'm, it, right now, it's ringing. So, if, if you were to come into the room. Okay. Let me. We usually do pretty good. No, just tell them we got less than usual. It's only four of us today. So some days it's all seven of us. Well, is that, it may be because it's cloudy. I mean, it's a wireless connection. But what I was going to say was that when you go in the room, if, if you don't mind. If I'm trying, right now, I'm, I'm, I'm ringing you to try to get you back into the same conversation. Because the last time I had to hang, call everybody else again. If they walk in the room, I think right now, because it's ringing, all you have to do is hit the green button to join it and to pop right back in. Thanks, Shannon. I appreciate it. You want to call, call me on your cell phone? Okay, thanks, Ian. All right, come. She's coming around again. So this is the boss coming around now, Miss Desi. So what I told her to do is rather than call us, I'm calling them right now. You see the yellow box? Okay, that's future care. All she's got to do is hit a green button and she'll rejoin. Who is that? So hopefully when she comes in, she'll see where it's, she's already in the group. All she's got to do is press the, the join the button to join the conversation, oh, okay. and then she doesn't have to call us again. That okay, can, so we just lost Sharon. Oh, she back. It's gotta be the it's gotta be the web of the people popping in and out. Yeah. So I'm just keep ringing it to see when she walks in if she can try. And then you have Diane. Two, where you at? I'm right here. I can see, yeah, I can see both real clear. And then mine came in super clear a minute ago. I'd never seen it that clear before. It's like she was in high death, but it didn't last long. Yeah. 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 Did Cassandra told me to tell you how? Lucy, she ain't retired yet. No. Poor Cassandra. What's her daughter doing? 
Yeah, she's doing really good. You know, me and her talk, we, we talk shop a lot. And uh, uh-huh. she always asks about you and me. You want to be defined all the damn time, okay? All the time. Like, if she told you need her to do something, she will purposely tell a man that she's not going to do it. Yeah. And she don't do it. Yeah. But as far as those awards go, those referrals, if she don't do them, I sent t- t- her an email. And she said, damn you, boss. I'm like, Cassandra, just get your work done. She said, yes, ma'am. Let me go and do it. I, and like, just like your big head over her. I said, don't bring him into this. Get your damn, we know damn work done. And she'll do it with a smile. You know she got a problem child, Jimmy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know There's mine. And we didn't get cut off. Thank you. That worked, oh, that worked out really good. Yeah, yeah. so we're all in. I didn't have to call anybody back. Sharon, where's Sharon? Go? Sharon. Oh, okay. I didn't see you. So mom is back, and she's, and she's looking at us for a second. And Miss Betty can hear us. Yeah. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Betty. I don't even answer no more. She thinks she's a part of this conversation. Yeah. Miss Betty. Yeah. We're trying to talk to Miss Lila. Well, there's a lot of noise in the background. Who's laughing? Yeah, that's, that's, that's somebody TV. I don't even have a TV on, so me either. It's not me. I have no TV on today. That's a lot of them just laughing. What if Sharon was moving in fast motion just now? Where did you where'd you go? Sharon go oh oh she must have went to get some. No, she Something was moving in fast motion. It was like somebody sped the film up. I was like, what the world is that? Oh, I don't know. But I looked at it, it looked like she was eating a sandwich. Then she got up, and that's Sharon. Are you still there? Oh, there she goes. You can see her. I don't see her. There she gone again. Now she's back again. Now she's gone again. No, but I can see her. How, there she is. And then you're going, Diane. This is a bad connection day. That's all to it. Yeah, I It ain't their fault. Yeah. So mom looks like she's happy. She's self-contained today. She's got her doll. Yeah. And she's Thank smiling you. at it. And now oh, she's, she's, she's gone. That's she back. She's gone. She's back. Now she's gone. All right. Well, we... I had to see her. I had to embarrass. Then she got small when she left. Now, Diane, you're gone. I can see you now. Yeah, well, that might have been me. I'm holding her hand. Sharon, we can't hear you. I don't know what's going on. Your volume is not. Can, is your volume turned all the way up on okay. your phone, Sharon? I'm checked. Now you can hear. I can hear you now. But if whatever you said a second ago, nobody could hear you. Did anybody else hear Sharon before? Before she said, "I'll check." Because she was talking. It's a lot of metal in my kitchen. You see that? You saw Diane? Yeah. yeah she was moving like in, Sharon. You were moving in fast motion just now. Sharon, your lips are not moving with your voice. Like, uh, like somebody had turned up the, um, the tape on you. Her lips are not moving with her voice. Like you see in um, the movies, like when the, the monsters move, the, the, in them horror films, where people well, speed up real fast. Yeah. No, them Chinese movies. Yeah, it's like, what in the world? <laughs> No, I mean, you should have seen it. Diane caught it because I saw your eyes light up when you saw it, Diane. All of a sudden, Sharon, you just went in fast motion like somebody sped the tape up. Right. That's exactly how I look. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get try to get mine back. It's almost 4 o'clock now. Yeah, it's not going to work. So we can talk amongst ourselves. I will say what it is. We know mine's okay. They, I know that they're not, you know, they had that one employee... They got sick. But that's sort of a wake-up call reminder that this thing is still ongoing, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. So we can't, we can't, I mean, with they can't slack off. They've been doing great. Yeah. That's what we got to Yeah, the problem is, is as much as they will try to preach to the employees, because if we know there's no more patients coming in, everything is on lockdown there. Yeah. 
If right. an employee goes, if one of these young people goes around a family member, they don't know where they've been, or you know, let their guard down for a minute, this is what happens. Exactly. So I am sure that they're not happy about that one case because future care, that future care has been doing real good. They had about a good month with nobody, right? A month and a half, almost. Yeah, they did. They did. They doing the best of anyone that I know. Yeah. Know so of. I know that I know Mr. Wynn is not happy. And I'm sure that by now he's made those employees are not happy because he's not happy. Hey, what's the girl, Maya? Is that the one that we that normally comes in there? Yes. Did you see her today? Yeah. I actually made a. I, I, I said because she just. I said, aren't you going to stick your head in the camera and smile for us? And y'all know nobody was there, but there's a reason why I do that because you I know mean, we don't take any of it for granted. But she's stressed out, I'm sure. Cause they, it, it's just her and the supervisor, and you know the supervisor's only going to do so much, right? right? So she's probably got the whole load. She's doing everything she used to do and everything Charday used to do, and probably ain't getting no more money for it. And then got to be careful when she goes home because they worry about the virus and everything else. So it's got all those little factors into it. But I know they're doing the best they can, and just right now they, they keep us abreast of stuff that's going on. So at some point, maybe one day next week, we can talk about the care package again. And, and, the, and, the, um, and the, what you call, marker. Side, what we going to do about that well, I, did it, I know who, who, Rachel found something from someplace that was how much money? I don't remember. Yeah, we, we can do, if, if they're not going to, if they will allow outside vendors to pr provide the stone, um, we can do some competitive shopping, you know, and if we're going to get a, if we, remember, remember when we went to see Jimmy, I mean, Dad, they, they, they took us to Dad's uh, spot. Right. Man gave us a flyer. That's been a while. Yeah. But remember, he worked there. He's selling his own. Uh, right. They, and they're going to nipple and die me to death. Everybody's going to try to work you, and they're going to try to make you feel guilty. Of course, they want to sell you the most expensive stuff. Right. Yeah, but there, there are lots of other manufacturers. You know, there's places that you can go to Walmart and buy your own casket. Oh yeah. So you don't have you don't have to um, play games with these funeral homes anymore. So there's a way to get around stuff. So we can find something nice for mom and dad. That'll be that we whatever we get. If we're gonna get it, we, we got to be able to update it. You gotta pay. You gotta pay for care of it. Right, but I mean. They, I don't know if you have to. Because the reason why I'm gonna say that is that if something like they gotta cut the grass anyway. Now, if you wanna, cut, if one of us is gonna go out once a month and pull weeds, you know, because what they, again, it's a kind of a rip off. You, you know what I mean? I don't. They gotta cut the grass anyway. So you can't right. tell me they're not cutting the grass over there. Now, if you talk about pulling the weeds up around the marker. If, if we went and visited the day and, you know, just rotated or something like that, we could do that. If, I don't know what they were charging, but it wasn't some kind of crazy amount of money. It's oh. like five dollars to pay for them to take care of the grade. How much was it? It's like five, close to five hundred dollars. But how long was that for? Forever? Yeah. So apparently, you know, it's, it's, it's baloney. Because if it was five hundred dollars forever, think about that. So if you tell me for fifty years, it's only going to cost me five hundred dollars. I'm not right. trying to get out of it. I'm just being realistic. That they want to nickel and dime you for stuff and tell you that they have to do stuff. You know, there's a thing that they tell you where the, the law requires you have to involve a body, right? I've had a funeral home tell me that you have to, that they have to by law, right? Do you know when Jews are buried, they don't have to embalm them? That's funny. So how is there's a law? If, if there's a law, they'd have to do it, right? Right. Yeah, it's bullshit. I'm not trying to get out of it. I'm just saying we don't need to be ripped off by it. Oh, I agree. It's just to with me. Yeah, and that's what they do. So if we're going we're gonna to do it, we can get something for not really nice with it. Maybe even nicer than what they would put up there and probably for less money. Right. All I we agree. have to do is, is, is do a little bit of homework and figure out what it's going to cost and how much it's going to cost per person and just move move forward. Again, because they want to charge you to put it down. They're going to charge you for $500 extra for maintenance. Like I said, is that maintenance for a year, maintenance for 50 years, maintenance for 100 years? You know what I mean? 
It's just an extra five hundred dollars they're trying to get from me. They gotta cut the grass around. They they're not gonna walk past dad and mom's burial site and not cut the grass, cut everybody else's grass. So we already know that they they attack. But they again, it's 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 one of those fees like all your phone taxes and stuff. You're still paying for the Spanish American War on your phone bill. Just crazy stuff. So. But we can, we can, I, I just think we need to do some competitive shopping, that's all. And then find out whoever we get the stone from. The biggest issue is can we get a stone that can be updated? Because if we put mom's information on it now, can we go back later on when, that, when the time comes and put, you know, updated information on it? It's either that or buy two stones. Buy one for dad now and then buy one for the both of them later. I would rather buy one and put both names on it. Okay. You ain't said nothing to it. What do you think? I don't know because the price range varies from each place, so I don't know. But some of them... You can put my name on it. Unfortunately, I don't know if you would want to do that and the date. But what? put that put it together and wait. You know, add her name, add her date later. Yeah, they can. They, some of them can do that. There are places where you can yeah. get it, get it done. That yeah. Later on, you can take it and get it updated. Yeah, somebody would come out that week and probably update. Yeah. Right. So I don't know. This is this something we got. We got to. You know, nobody wants to think about it, but it's something that's going to have to be done at some point. In all fairness, the day in that mind. If we could find. And the works at the cemetery that Diane met, that would be our best bet. Well, that's we, that's the guy that works for what's the name? March. March owns March owns King's Park. We I met the man, and I'm just saying that we need to be com competitive. One of the things I've learned in my lifetime, having been in situations where I bought stuff and then found out later I could have got it for half what I spent, mm -hmm. is that if you do the homework up front. We like you turn York. They already told you they we don't have to get a stone from them, right? Right. Yeah. right. So I'm just saying that I saw that bill. What it's going to cost about three thousand dollars for a stone. By the time we put it, they put in that little extra stuff, three four thousand dollars for a stone, right? Yeah. Then I know the other places that have stones for a thousand dollars for two thousand dollars. But even if we have to pay them five hundred dollars to lay the stone on the ground. It may be cheaper, and it still might be a nicer stone. That's all I'm saying. Then I don't know who's done and how much homework anybody's done, but we need to get at least two or three options before we start spending money. Because I would just hate to spend four thousand dollars to find out we could have did the same thing. And other people, what I hate to find is somebody come telling me you spent four thousand dollars for that, that stone, and <clears throat> they have a family member out there, and they spent half the half of that money and got a nice stone too. So, I mean, I'm, I'm open to anything. I just don't want us to get, as a group, to get burned because they will take advantage of you, particularly when they know, you know, this is a touchy subject. It's a family member, a loved one, and they're going to tell you, you know, you want to do this in style, you want to do right by your dad, and get this this, this stone here. We can do this, get you in here for only $4,500. And I don't know. I think that, you know, I'm, I just... I, I looked online and saw where they were three places that were selling them for a lot less money. And we, didn't, we ain't gonna buy nothing plastic, we, nothing plastic, nothing from a dollar store. You know, it's gonna be the shit, and it's gotta be something that can be we can fix it later. Like the, if we're gonna put mom's information on, we gotta be able to have it updated. That's the most important thing. So, okay, because they got you know they got granite stones. Then they got they got bronze stones, and then they had that those other metals, and now they can do things like they can put photographs on them. You know what I mean? So like that picture, of Dad and Mom at their fiftieth anniversary, you could put their picture on there or something like that. So it could, it could be something really nice, you know. And it, and again, all we gotta do is just check. If it, it may turn out in the end that the cheapest thing we can do, I don't know who's still online. But maybe the cheapest thing we can we have to, the best.